your phantom smells of smoke and cigarettes and exhaust fumes is very possibly a sign of menopause, perimenopause transition, and it's showing that there is an estrogen decline. The estrogen decline that happens can affect the olfactory nerve, your neurotransmitters, your neuromodulators, the mucosa of the sinus cavity. In some research that I will post about, it will talk about ossifications and the cribriform plate. So it's nerve, it's mucosa, it is neurotransmitters, and it sounds like every other thing that happens with menopause. And this should be no surprise to any of us. This smell is one of the symptoms for some people, not all people. People are unique. We have all a different ride and experience, and our experiences do lead us up to how we have our menopause transition. Our deficits really become apparent. So not all phantom smells are part of the menopause transition, however, if you have other signs of menopause, such as, let's say, hot flashes, brain fog, muscle wasting, visceral fat, you kind of know that it's one of the symptoms. But as estrogen declines, things become more brittle. It seems that it affects all tissues in our body, and it wouldn't be surprising that it would affect the mucosa in our sinus cavity. Think of dry mouth, dry eyes, dry... So neurotransmitters, I mean, think about ADHD with perimenopause and all the cognitive issues that happen due to inflammation. So why do some people have this phantom smell of smoke and others don't? There isn't enough research to tell us why, but it shouldn't be surprising based on the physiology and science of what does happen in estrogen decline because estrogen affects your olfactory nerve, which is a cranial nerve, which is kind of wild.